Hey, afternoon you guys, Donna here. We're gonna try this again. I, uh, I was just been praying all day to be inspired. Like I wanted to connect with you. Uh, anything that, you know, I could receive that, you know, would inspire myself or if I could be of service and help inspire someone else. And so I was praying and I was trying to do an invocation asking for guidance and so I got up and I started walking and I have been outside more and more than ever and I used to be outside all the time and the reason I say that is um, I just started thinking about you know we've all heard about the Aborigines and the Australian people and they talk about a walkabout I'm going on a walkabout or she was gone on a walkabout for a long time and, and when I think about that I think how powerful that is because that person is going outside to be with Mother Earth, right? And Mother Earth is so healing. I mean, look at how many trillions and trillions and trillions of living creatures that she feeds and shelters and how powerful she is. I mean, you just gotta be in a good storm to see how powerful she is. Um, the waters, our air, the greenery, I'm looking at beautiful greenery right now. And so, you know, I wanna say before I forget, and I've been guilty of this myself, be kind to your mother. Mother Earth is your mother. And she is set up to, um, she's given us so much, that's all I'm gonna say. But I was thinking about that walkabout and the inspiration, because as soon as I started walking, I got inspired and uh, how meditative it is. I mean, you literally can be off center or be stressed. And if you will go outside and take your shoes off and walk on the grass or the ground and just spend some time out there, you literally, your chakras will start aligning. You will literally become calmer. You will become grounded and rooted in who you are, you know? So grounded and rooted in who you are, right? And so when you think about um, the root chakra. You know, when I think about that, um, there's a couple of things that come up that would be really simple if you've never even done anything like this. I am outside getting bit too. I love y'all, right? Okay. A lot of people know me. They know I don't like bugs. Um, anyway, <laughs> I mean, you literally at, uh, at your root chakra, which is at the base of the spine, you could even right now just envision just a red fiery light at your at the at the base of your spine and you could imagine that lighting up and breathe like breathe three deep breaths like you know you just start with anybody can do this right anybody you don't have to be a magic meditator you can just breathe in and then you breathe out And you do it again. So for the sake of the time, I'm not gonna do that, right? And you just imagine that red light lighting up and being grounded and rooted in who you are. Because really what that does is it tethers you to Mother Earth so that you can feel safe because you feel unsafe. And that's why you're agitated and you're frustrated. You're feeling unsafe. The day has not gotten off of you. You know what I mean? Or several days or several weeks and somebody bumps into you at the grocery store and it rattles your frame and you and you just, you can't even catch your breath, right? So get grounded in who you are. Get grounded in Mother Earth. Envision, this is what I do. I envision like roots of a tree because I love trees. Like we breathe the same air they breathe. And so I imagine these roots going down in the ground and I feel safe, okay? And that's what we want, that, that we are all that we all, we are, we are all that we are, and to be rooted and grounded in Mother Earth. And so what I'm going to do is tell you to have a super great afternoon. Can you see that sun? It's coming through. I'm not even going to fight it. I want to tell you that I, that I wish you and send you blessings and happiness. And you have made my day, and thank you for allowing me to do this. And yeah, just, just have a great day.